both brands um, are positioned around things other than the product themselves. So we did a big piece of research probably five or six years ago now uh, that, that really to get us to understand how we could pull the brands apart but have a very differentiated positioning within the market. And I guess one of the key things that, that, that came out very strongly is butter actually isn't particularly interesting to people. Um, so, so we took a strategy to say let's associate ourselves and our brands with things that people are interested in. So from a Lurpak perspective, um, we target a, a group called Creative Foodies. Um, that group very, very interested in food. So let's associate Lurpak um, with all things about food and good food. And from an anchor perspective, um, it's all around um, social interaction um, and particularly the family. Um, so anchoring anchor into that family and social environment um, and, and really being part of the family. So Lurpak has been very consistent over a, a period of probably six or seven years now uh, and we've used the uh, Good Food Deserves Lurpak Creative um, which has been developed with Wyden and Kennedy um, and we've taken lots of different um, angles of how we explore the world of food um, and what's Lurpak's opinion on that world of food but it's all around that emotional tie-in that people have with food and associating Lurpak with that. I think one of the, the, the best performing ads um, was around a, uh, a Wednesday night meal and how uh, our food hero comes back from a hard day at work and puts together a simple omelette um, using Lurpak um, but really about using fresh ingredients and simple ingredients to create a, a, a great food occasion even though it's just him sitting at home eating an omelette. From a media planning perspective, um, we always think about the audience first. So it's, it always has to be who is the audience we're trying to get to. And on Lurpak and Anchor, we have very defined audiences. So we find that TV um, is a central pillar to our media um, campaigns. Very little other media is ability to get the reach um, that, that TV can do and the scale that TV can do. Um, but we do find that, that, that putting TV with other media types really amplifies the campaign and, and other media types are able to get to some of the areas where TV maybe can't. Um, but as a whole package, um, we find that using TV as a central pillar um, and then adding on specific other media is, is the best way um, to achieve and, and to get to our target audiences. For both Lurpak and Anchor, we have um, consistently outperformed the market. Um, we have, uh, from a Lurpak perspective, um, in the last five years, we have become the number one brand in the market. Um, we're now about £100 million bigger than our co key competitor in the market. And we've seen consistent growth year on year um, on, on both brands. I think in terms of payback and, and how our brands have, have, have really achieved the payback um, in this tough FMCG environment, um, I think it's through um, having a very distinct audience, being clear about who that audience is, um, but also having um, advertising and creative that really stands out um, and enables us to get much more cut through um, and deliver that, that ROI. So we've taken the view at Arla that um, investment over a longer period of time and that consistent investment um, is key to delivering great ROI on our advertising and, and that's really what has been the key to our success um, of effective advertising by investing consistently year after year. Looking to the future, um, TV will still be a really important part of our plans going forward. Um, I think we obviously need to look at TV um, with that media mix and how things like digital come into that. Um, but I do think that TV is still central, it still gets the reach, it still gets the cover, but it's how TV interacts with those other media and I think um, having that multimedia platform is, is, is becoming increasingly important, but it's how, how we move with that smartly. Who can say what the journey might throw at us?